The materials that you'll need are pretty straightforward. You'll need a 3cc syringe attached to some sort of blunt tip needle in order to draw up the medication. You'll need the medication that you wish to administer intranasally. You'll need an alcohol prep pad to clean that top of that medication vial. And then you'll need the intranasal atomizer. The first thing you're gonna do is take your needle and syringe and drop your medication safely. The important thing to note here is that in addition to your intended dose of medication, you must draw up 0.1 milliliters extra of medication to account for the dead space within the atomizer. You can then remove the needle and attach the atomizer directly to the syringe. Prior to administering the medication, you should push 0.1 milliliters through the atomizer to avoid the dose being trapped in the atomizer dead space. The max dose of medication or the max volume shouldn't exceed greater than one milliliter per nostril. You should be priming the atomizer, which is just drawing up the 0.1 milliliters of medication in addition to the intended dose to account for the atomizer dead space. The atomizer doesn't need to be reprimed between nostrils. Common medications to consider when doing intranasal administration are fentanyl and Versed. And remember that the atomizers are single use and you should dispose of them when they're done.